Tick tock on the clock, cause the figures don't stop. We got another haul for you today. I do apologize. The haul I submitted earlier today was actually from last night. Um, so the chronology is a little bit off. It's still, you know, in the same order, but it's just at a slightly different time. Now, what's exciting about this haul, let me take that out. We have five figures. I was thinking, you know what, I might as well just finish off the Lego Movie series. But, we had a small problem with that. They're starting to decline in at least my target. Now, that's not just from me buying them. That, not that kind of decline. I saw they had originally two shelves full, but now they're down to one shelf. And even that shelf is about, maybe even has half or less of the figures. I felt every package and tried to be careful about what I chose. So, basically, the three I have here are ones I do not already have, and here's the surprise. I found this in the side of an aisle, and I checked it very carefully to be sure that this is the Forest Maiden. If it's not, oh, you don't want to see me. <laughs> I will not be actually angry, but, or at least not on camera. They had a few of these left, but I knew two of them were ones I already had. This one, I believe, is the Evil Mech. How about we just do those first, because I'm excited. Because if I get this one as the Forest Maiden, this will complete my Series 9 collection. I didn't think it would be possible to. <gasps> oh, yes! Yes! I was really, really skeptical. Because I didn't... You know, when these, were in, when these were still being sold, I did not think they would have this figure. I checked all the packages. They were as best as I could. Wow. Oh my gosh, you don't know how happy I am now. I'm trying not to be sarcastic happy, because um, I'm not. I'm really happy. I'm, I have finished my second collectible minifigure series so far. The first one, sorry about that. The first one I completed was series 10. Now I have series 9 complete. I won't get to series 11 being complete unless they just happen to have some more of those... Um, Figures that I don't have. I, I think I'm only missing three from this series. Evil Mech, the Grandma, and the Island Warrior. And this one is also... Boom! I am good at this. Today we also have the Evil Mech. Which I do like the arm printing on him. Didn't notice that. Got some nice Blacktron throwback on the torso. And on a little bit on the armor. So this is nice. This one I, I wasn't sure about because it had an odd piece and the odd piece is actually the blaster pieces. So, woo! Nice. Alright, let's get on to the LEGO Movie figures. I don't remember which is which, but I believe they are Wily Fusebot. Uh, what were the other ones? The, the Miss Scratchin' Post, which is right here. Ooh, there are the pants. Get those built. Doing a little dance. Woo! That's it. That's exactly how it came out, so. The cat was very difficult. I could not figure out what that piece was, because it's different from some of the, you know, it's not it's not the same as some other cats that we've had in the past. So I was really confused by that piece. I did not think it was gonna be that small. Um uh, trying to remember what the other guesses were. How about we just open up and find out? And this one, oh yeah, William Shakespeare. Oops, almost missed the hair. That one is kind of easy to feel for after finding the 2x2. Two two. Trying to get this built quickly so you guys can see the figures. He's got a nice face on him. He doesn't look exactly like the, um, the actor, which I, I wasn't really worried about, but it was something on my mind a little bit. After all, he does have a similar torso printing just not the same color. So, Wiley, here we go. So far, the hardest ones for me to find... Oops, all the way off. Yeah! All right. His... His face is actually stuck in the... hat. This one includes... Oops, there goes the hair. I mean, the head. This one includes a little beard piece. I'll just put that right on. Got the coonskin hat. That's what it's called, right? 
This is a nice figure. Once I figured out the, um, the dynamite, I was certain it was him, but I also felt around for some of the other pieces. Because I wasn't too sure about those, but the dynamite was a good giveaway on that one. So, we are down to two more figures to complete the LEGO Movie Series. We only have two more figures to complete the Series 11, but we're not going to get to that because they're probably not in stores anymore after this one. And we have a complete Series 9. Woo! I gotta do... Do you guys want me to do a, a review of the entire Series 10 and then the entire Series 9 is one big video? Because I've been doing these minifigures piecemeal, just in case I don't finish the series, and it would be better to focus on each figure independently. But I, uh, let me know in the comments if you want to see an entire series review, because I would be willing to do that if you want me to. So, thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you next time. Woo! I'm so happy.